Hallelujah. I welcome you, my brothers, my sisters, my colleagues, my elders, my seniors in Celestial Church of Christ. Once again, I have come so that we can look at one thing that is dipping, eating deep into our way of worship. And that is the cherubim and seraphim ways of worship that is infiltrating into our own way of worship. I advise each and every one of us in Celestial Church of Christ to stay away from the cherubim and seraphim ways of worship in Celestial Church. For example, trance. Trance also in Celestia, we can see that in page 3, article 3 of the Constitution, in that the first name of Celestia Church of Christ was brought by a man who was in, the, in trance on the seventh day that he, he gave the name to Papa Oshofa himself. So, there is trance. We believe in it that it exists. But the way in which a celestial prophet goes to trance and descend, it is not what we are seeing on social media going on in churches these days. We see clapping of hands and entertainment dancing, which we see of the cherubim and seraphim set. It is not celestial. In celestial, we don't clap hands and sing that they walk me a row and man face woman, man face man, or woman face man, all sort of and begin to. There is orderliness in celestial church of Christ. Men on men's side, women on women's side, we sing and worship God. We sing and praise God Almighty. There is not the commotion that man and woman now will face and they will be going around clapping and doing roundabouts inside the church. That is why I call it entertainment worship, entertainment dancing. We are not the same. Many people may say, ah, because they wear white garments, we wear white garments. We all wear white garments, but we are not the same. Celestial Church of Christ is different from cherubim and seraphim. When cherubim and seraphim come to our church, they are all welcomed. When we invite them for our occasion, they are welcome to come and to join us, but not to change our ways of doing things. When we invite them on the occasion and they sing their song and then we do as they do in cherubim and seraphim, then how will they know that they are in a different environment? How will they know what they miss or what they lack in their own sect? But if our way is to sing their song, clap hands and entertain as they do in their own church, then how will they see a different uh, environment or know a different way of worship? For example, when the choristers sing, Whenever we invite cherubim and seraphim to our harvest or whenever we are doing anything, then the chorister will always continue to sing the spiritual songs of cherubim and seraphim. Even more, hardly will we hear the seraphim song. We have more songs than them. We hear their song. Where is those our songs? Or Joagbar are not your song. Where is the song? Jesus the Joba. Where is the song? Joria Hihu. Where is the song? Baba Pala Shela Torunwa. Where is the songs? Malika Meji Torun Sokalewa. Where is the songs? Agbara Lauti To Toti Somo Mejiwa. Where is the songs? E Mimimo Sokale Sariwa. We will not hear those songs. We begin to wait. Atewa Ko Miaru. Ko Miaru. And they will begin to clap, dance, and sing all songs that are less powerful and less greased than that which. Jesus Christ gave unto Papa Oshofa for Celestia Church of Christ. So please, I do not see why 
we should continue to copy or imbibe or emulate things that are not of the level of celestial church of Christ. Kerubu and Seraphim church is the church of the angels. And celestial church of Christ is the church of Christ. Now, which is better? Which is more greased? I want you to judge yourself. I confidently, I am telling you 100% that celestial church of Christ is better. Celestial church of Christ is more greased. Celestial church of Christ is more powerful. John the Baptist is only the forerunner, not the Messiah. Jesus Christ is the Messiah. Jesus Christ is the owner of Celestial Church of Christ. And it is him that has sent Papa Oshofa. Papa Oshofa also confirmed it. He said what I am saying because many of us may be saying that, where is this man getting what he's saying or what he's saying? I always refer, go back to the constitution of Celestial Church of Christ. I want each and every one of you who have the opportunity to have the constitution. And I, I recommend the constitution for every bona fide member of Celestial Church of Christ, male or female, so that the confusion that is happening in Celestial Church of Christ, the infiltration, the adulteration of worship, that is currently happening in Celestial Church of Christ, we will be abreast of it. We will know better. Let us look what Papa said in page 9, Article 29 of our Constitution. The first question was from one man. We called Alex Aganyimi. He is a man called Alex Aganyimi. A member of the Cherubim and Seraphim Church. A member of the Cherubim and Seraphim Church. Mm -hmm. He was Togolese. He was a Togolese. Mm -hmm. Whenever a question was asked, mm -hmm. whenever a question of was asked, Paul Shofa then, mm -hmm. one of my ears. This is Papa Shofa now saying he's the one relating this uh, incident. One of his ears mm -hmm. gave a high pitched. Gave noise. a high pitched noise. Mm -hmm. While the other was silent. While the other was silent. Mm -hmm. The noisy ear did not hear what was being asked. Mm -hmm. While the quiet one did. Mm -hmm. Alex said he understood that Moses or Rimolade mm -hmm. was sent by God and he performed all kinds of spiritual Now this works. brother Alex Agonimi of the Kerubim and Seraphim. Now he's professing and telling Papa or Shofa that he knows that Moses Ori Molade was sent by God with this Kerubim and Seraphim. Mm -hmm. Now I came along again and claimed that God sent me. Now he is telling Papa Oshofa that you have now come again now to tell us now that uh, it's God Almighty that has sent you with this celestial church of Christ. Mm -hmm. Which should they accept? Now which should they accept? The noisy ear became quiet. Now the noisy ear, remember that Papa is a prophet. The noisy ear became quiet. Mm -hmm. And I heard as follows. And the ear heard as follows. With regard, regard mm -hmm. to your question. Mm -hmm. Regarding your question. John the Baptist mm -hmm. came before Jesus. That like John the Baptist is the forerunner came before Jesus. Mm -hmm. You must surely know that cherubims and seraphims are angels of all of whom wait upon and worship our Lord This Jesus. is what uh, Papa Oshofa heard, that the Spirit, Holy Spirit was telling him, and he was relaying it to that brother, uh, Alex Agonini, that you must know that Kerubim and Seraphim is the forerunner, came before him. Uh -huh. Kerubim and Seraphims are angels. Kerubim and Seraphims are angels' church. All of whom wait upon and worship our Lord they Jesus. They wait upon and worship our Lord Jesus Christ. 
the celestial church of Christ. But the celestial church of Christ is Christ's church. It is the church of Christ. It is Christ's church. Mm -hmm. While the church of the cherubims and seraphims while the church of the cherubim and seraphims belongs to the angels of God. Belongs to the angels. Mm -hmm. And is no more than a forerunner. And it is no more. Listen to what the Spirit, Holy Spirit, told Papa Oshofa, which he relayed in that crusade, that it is no more, Kerubim and Seraphim is no more than a forerunner. Mm -hmm. To prepare the way to for, prepare the way for celestial church for of celestial Christ. church of Christ. Whether the world likes it or not. Now this is what the Holy Spirit is saying. You know, it is not the opinion of Adeyemi Thomas that you are looking at and it is not the opinion of Papa or Shofa in his days, but what the Holy Spirit of God was telling him, that is what he was relaying. Whether the world likes it or not, its glory will soon become known to all my That this glory will soon become known to the whole world. This was what was written down in 1947. Me and you, let us judge now. If the glory is not known now, the glory of celestial church of Christ is it not known worldwide more than that of cherubim and seraphim? If this is what the Holy Spirit have told us through Papa or Shofa, why then is celestial church of Christ, that is the church of Christ, complete, graced, more powerful, more blessed? more glorious why is it now going back to what the forerunner of the church brought so my prayer to all my colleagues in celestial church of christ to all brothers and sisters in celestial church of christ is to hold on fast to what we have i am confident i have 100 percent trust belief and faith in the worship of god in celestial church of christ i will never infiltrate it with anything that is not celestial not for the sake not to please human beings, not to please my brothers and sisters in Kirubim and Seraphim. When they come, they will come, worship with us together in our own way of worship. And any one of them who really believe and in spirit will see that truly Kirubim and Seraphim is only a forerunner to the glory that is to come and that has came, which is Celestial Church of Christ. It is not for Celestial Church of Christ to go back to the forerunner. That is why I say we are not the same and we will never be the same. It is not of you to put, say, because we want to satisfy our friends, our brothers and sisters in Kerubu by our words, our soothing words to say we are the same. No. We are not. The Holy Spirit told Papa Oshofa, we are not the same. Because the angels, the cherubim and seraphim, are not the same as their master and Lord, Jesus Christ. So, what the angels brought is not the same and will never be the same with what Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, brought himself. So, please, I implore us, all those ways in cherubim and seraphim that we see some of our celestial elders colleagues practicing let us try as much as possible to desist from it and follow this way of god in celestial church of christ Ile miri ko le boriwa ni oruko Jesu Kristi oluwa ti gbalawa amen
I greet you. I will see you next week again when we'll come up with something else. Another thing that is eating deep to the Celestial Church of Christ ways and mode of worship. God bless you.